Hi, this is a case of a presumed candida endothelmitis in relation to in, uh, intravenous drug use that was treated with uh, systemic fluconazole and intravitreal voriconazole. Uh, the patient lesion uh, healed well, uh, but she was left with vitreous opacities as well as macular uh, traction. Uh, vitrectomy was um, undertaken mainly to um, remove the vitreous opacities as well as the macular uh, traction. She also had some cataracts, so we removed the cataract at the same time. Uh, this is the start of the vitrectomy. There are vitreous opacities, which I'm removing. Now attention uh, will be given to induce the hyaloid uh, separation. So going at a disc, high vacuum, uh, wait for a few seconds, then pull up. And uh, after several attempts, I was able to get the hyaloid separated. Now peripheral vitrectomy, uh, working at the edge of the uh, hole I made in the hyaloid and working all the way around. Unless there's significant uh, peripheral pathology, I usually, uh, I'm usually not very aggressive with uh, vitreous uh, removal in the periphery and I don't really uh, do extensive vitreous base shaving. Now staining the epiretinal membrane uh, with ICG. Uh, the view was not very good due to vitreous opacification and posterior capsule opacification, so I removed the capsule and anti vitreous. Now the view is better and epiretinal membrane peeling using um, 25 gauge um, ILM forceps. In general, I do not uh, remove the ILM after ERM peel, but in this case, there was residual uh, traction on the macula, and I was intending not to do anything for the uh, disc, uh, the peri uh, disc lesion. So I, I went on to remove the ILM after restaining. The ILM is already opened. And now is peeled off the macula. Now the legion around the disc is healed and I left it alone. Any attempt to remove it would end up in a retinal tear, uh, which is really not needed. 360 screen indentation reveals another healed uh, peripheral uh, fungal lesion, but there were no retinal tears. I left the eye uh, fluid filled. And that's the end of the surgery. Thank you.